Hello everybody, today we're unboxing a Raspberry Pi 4 wash. There we go. We have ordered it from the Pi Hut, absolutely not sponsored. We are going to use this in our podcast studio where we need to put various advertisements for the podcast artwork and we need a computer. Oh, thank you for your order, very nice there. Check them out. So what have we got in the box? Okay, up first we have a Raspberry Pi 4 Model B. This is a fantastic unit. I went for the unit with eight gigabytes of RAM. Basically, I went for the full power um, Raspberry 4 uh, unit. 64-bit um, quad-core processor, eight gigs of RAM, two micro HDMI ports. Did you know you can actually run dual monitors on this unit? You've also got two USB 3, two USB 2.0 ports, a gigabyte ethernet port. You can also do wireless, run Bluetooth, and you can also power the whole thing on a USB sink. Open here. Pull the bit that says open here, that helps. So as you can see, we have the Raspberry Pi 4, and this is a fantastic little unit that I use across uh, other devices at home. Uh, you can also use it to run things like a Plex server. So there you can see we've got the USB 3.0, the 2.0 ethernet port, and then here you've got two micro HDMI, the audio jack plug for speakers, and you can power the board on the USB-C. Fantastic little unit, but to show you the size, fits in the palm of your hand, and it is a great little computer there. So that is obviously, empty then it needs to be a dorm stuff what else do we get in the box well we get a micro hdmi lead which will plug into the board so obviously we can hook up to a monitor which is fantastic and we can also open this box here and this kit has come with the extra raspberry pi usb c charger but obviously it's a standard usb c charger that you can use but obviously this is the official one so great to power the unit and then finally in the box Two more things in the bag. We have a small case to put the Raspberry Pi in, nicely finished space to put the SD card in, the end which we've got in the box, and you can house the unit in there very comfortably. There's some adhesive dots to put in there. De house the unit in there so that it's not as vulnerable, obviously, just being the circuit board. So the idea is we're gonna mount this in the unit and then what we are going to do, obviously I'll do this properly with the dots and things, but as you can see, it fits out with the IO there and the plugs. We're then gonna attach a, a command strip or similar to the back, and then we can apply the unit to a TV. And the last thing we have in here is a micro SD card, with, which is the Raspberry Pi SD card, and we'll have to load up the various um, OS system onto the card and put that in the pie and then we just need to attach any other storage that we need and last but not least the pie hut sticker cheers guys great job